hi guys welcome or welcome back to my channel my name is Kiana so today I'll be filming how to maintain your braids and four ways how to style your braids so first I'm going to show you like the stuff I use to maintain my hair the main things I use is this it's the coconut oil it's ultra care like you can get this at Walmart and it's like really really good so and it's like really really oily too and, and a little goes a long way too so you just want to wrap your hands like that and you just go around your edges because you know when you like get your hair done and then like after like two days because it's like so tight your edges like start to look like white and start to cover around your edges and then you put like gel to do your edges and then it's just showing it. And you want to get it in the back too, like the very, very back, because that's where most of it is. So you want to get like a lot back there. But as I said before, a little goes a long way, so you don't really have to like put that much. And another place you should do is like the sides here around your ear, because there, get those stuff too. Or because your hair is like pulled back like that. That's why you get those stuff. So the next thing I use is this. It's the African Shea Butter. It looks like this and you can get this at Walmart too. Like both the products I just showed you. You can either get it at Walmart, Target, or anywhere. And this is actually really thick and this body and hair. So you can put it on your body. And it really clears my skin up. So this too, you can just put it on your edges and just go through it. It goes around me so you really don't have to use that much, but I use a lot. And you just put it on your edges like that. Instead of oil, you just hold your scalp to like parts like in here. And you can use this too, but I, I prefer to use the oil. And like the last thing you need to maintain your hair to me is just satin caps or silk. Because they, like, they have like a silky material. I just got this one because it looks cute. And this one's just like a regular black one. So you guys should definitely invest in these because like they keep your hair better than cotton. So first, I have a half up, half down, and... You just want to take these braids here and you want to leave some at the back too so you want to take from like the very top of your hair because you want to like make it like really high like you're doing a bun and you want to make it look even too I really can't see anything because the light is in my eyes but first you want to like even it out to see how you want it like because you know it's half up half down and then you're gonna get your rubber bands preferably the big ones and just do this as how many times you'd like dependent on the size of your braids and then you bring it out like this because you don't want it to be like stiff at the top and just make like make it like spread to fall in with the back so now you can see and it looks like that so for the second style it's like it's kind of like half up half down but it's going to be two ponytails so if you want to as I said before make it look even you're gonna bring some up and make a, like a little part in the middle so it's like the, the ponytails are even and you're because you're making two on either side so you just want to get like the right amount but you don't have to be like too precise you know what i mean so as i said before you get two of the bands because it secures it more to me my that's my opinion and you just want to wrap it how many times you'd like, as I said before, depending on the size of your braids. Once you that and pull it up into a ponytail to make sure they're in the same place because you're going to look ridiculous if they're not in the same place. And I just have 42 of these because, in my opinion, they secure it better. So as you can see, it came out like this. I feel like this one is a little higher. But it still looks okay to me so as you can see it came out like this I tried to make them the same size as perfect as possible but you know and the back just looks like that and as I said before just try to make these 
fall in with the back. So for the third style, you could just keep these two because I'm just actually gonna just turn them into a bun. So what you're gonna wanna do is you're gonna take this and wrap it into a messy bun. It doesn't have to be perfect because you can fix it with bobby pins or rubber bands. And first you could take the big rubber band to secure it. You could try to make them look the same size. Well, you should. And you want to get another rubber band to secure this one. So they don't come out as you'd like. You just want to go in and take the smaller rubber bands to like fix it for how you'd like it. This is what it came out like, but I feel like you guys get the idea. You guys probably can do it better than I do, but this is the idea, okay? So for the fourth and final style, like I like to do is a top bun. So what you wanna do is like, I personally sometimes, I feel like leaving some at the front looks better. And I'm gonna show you what I'm talking about. So you wanna go in the middle, like here, and Grab some of your rubber bands, not see anything, so if I look like a tree monster, you know I need to two rubber bands, as I said before, because I feel like that secures it better. A lot of times people leave it like this, but I don't know, I'll probably try this one day, but personally, I wouldn't wear it like that. So, uh, I'm gonna go like that, and make your bun or whatever shapes it comes out at this point. <laughs> and you just wanna wrap it as tight as possible and get your rubber bands to secure it. Just gonna go like that, and like that. Said before, not necessarily, but as I said before, if you don't like the shape of your bun when you're done, like I do right now, you could just go in with a smaller rubber band to make it the shape you want it. This is a complete fiasco. So this is how it came out guys. So it's just like a top knot at this point and it's supposed to be a bun but it just let the back fall and I think this Hairstyle is really cute on me. Not at the moment because the bun needs some fixing. So yeah. So that's it for today's video, guys. Make sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe. And if you want, guys want to see more videos on how to style your hair, just comment down below. And I'll make more videos. Peace.